Hey what's up guys it's Nick from Exploit Theory and in this video I'll be showing you how to object fly to get out of the first mission in and out in the Crossfire X's Operation Catalyst campaign. So to do this you'll need an object that you can fly with. Now most of the chairs in this game you can fly with like this one shown. We're at the very start of the game here and I've taken this chair from that fiery room in the back to over here where I can get some height. You want to lay the chair on the back like it is shown on the video, stand up, get into the chair and crouch down and then knife into it as you push forwards. This will get the chair stuck to you and you want to keep pushing forwards until the chair sort of changes direction. Once it's changed direction like this, try walking backwards or forwards or left and right and you should be able to float up with it. You want to now use the chair to get to any height that you need. I tried to get on top of this roof, but I found out that there was no glitch in here. Luckily, I landed on one of these balconies here, which got me out of the map anyway. From this position, you can explore a couple of the rooftops on top of here, and you can go off outside and drop down on each of the balconies and get to a deloaded part of the map. Now in this clip you can see it's not just chairs that you can do it with, you can do it with glass tables like this one shown. Now the best place I think to do this glitch is at this part in the mission here. You'll need to be careful though in case you die. Take a right here and then you'll see this blue lawn chair. You want to crouch down and knife it all the way to where I do, killing any enemies that show up in the process. You're going to take damage from the long distance enemies, but there's not much you can really do about that. So if you do get too hurt, just find some cover and heal up before going back to the chair. I'm bringing it over to this side of this building that we will be going into. I'm going to position this chair on its back just like the other one at the start of the mission. I'm going to do the same thing, walk into it, crouch, then knife to get myself stuck in it and move forward into it, getting it stuck and allowing us to now fly. I'm going to try and make my way over to this building without going too high as there is full damage in this game which you can get injured by very easily. To get out of the chair I'm going to use the slow down time ability and try and run out of the chair. Now from here what I'm doing is I'm going to drop down onto these rocks and make it onto this road. Now all of this road has collision all out the map. You want to shoot the ground just to make sure on the left and right side before you try exploring. If there's bullet collision it means you can walk on it. If not then don't walk on it. We think that this glitch will be able to be used through both of these campaigns and I'll be uploading separate videos for each of the maps as we find the best ways to get out. This glitch was found by our team here at Exploit Theory. If you've enjoyed the video at all, then go ahead and hit that like button. And if you'd like to see more content like this, then go ahead and hit that subscribe button. If you'd like to hang out with either me or the rest of the Exploit Theory team, then we do have a Discord server, which is linked in the description box below. Thanks so much for liking and watching the video, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.
Jesus.